my first impressions of this amazing Grob 109 uh, Able. It's the aeroplane it always should have been. So the engine is just remarkable. It's carefree handling, it's constant speed, variable pitch propeller, uh, you can apply power as you need it, and there's plenty of power there, it's amazing. I've got close to a thousand hours on the Grob 109 now, um, and the more I fly it, the more I appreciate it to be the most amazing compromise aeroplane. And I really feel this has just uh, raised the bar and set the Grob 109. It's, it's, it's reinvigorated the type, hopefully for another 50 years. I think the market for this is going to be twofold. I think um, many Grob 109 owners, um, as the engine is now unsupported, when they need a new engine, I think it's the obvious choice uh, to fit the new engine. Um, and if you're looking for a new aeroplane, I would say this is an amazing, amazing choice uh, at the correct price point. I had one of those airability pinch me moments uh, the whole of yesterday. So we started off uh, with a photo mission over Schloss Neuschwanstein, my, my, my fairy tale castle made famous by Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Um, so we were flying in very close formation with another grob uh, taking photographs. Uh, we landed, refueled, uh, and then flew all the way back to UK. Uh, uh, and that was just incredible as well. So um, the aeroplane has so much power now. Um, I cruised straight up to 10,000 feet for an effortless crossing through uh, lots of bad weather. Uh, the aeroplane is remarkable.